welcome to my channel if you are new here hello you are spiritually connected with katiba that's for sure all right look they not like us they not like us chosen one look they are not like us but you already knew that i'm just here to confirm it <laughs> they are not like us and this is not to be like on some egotistic type stuff i'm just saying what it is the truth is what it is like it is what it is the proof is in the pudding they are not like us we are not like them we are not the same we like some whole aliens walking around here okay <laughs> we like some whole aliens walking around out here and this is why people be like just staring this is why people just can't get enough like this is why people don't like us for no reason like because they are not like us and they can't figure us out so not only are they not like us they can't figure us out they they look at you they sense something different they look at you you look a little different they look at you they feel you you feel different and not only all of that they observe in the room and they see how other people are responding to you they are not like us show them us and we are not like them and quite honestly we don't want to be <laughs> we don't want to be like i said it ain't to be on no egotistic type stuff but chosen when you the shit you the shit okay i don't know if nobody told you or not but you the shit and you are so unique and you stand so you like you have so much pride in not being like everyone else like you're able to authentically be yourself like you allow your personality to shine like i'll be i'll be quite honest a lot of us we got like these little quote unquote like these little janky personalities we do i ain't gonna lie my personality is like i don't know if <laughs> i don't know if i didn't if i wasn't me if i would be like <laughs> cool with me or whatever i don't know because it takes a, a special type of person it takes a special type of person for one on top of that i'm a virgo so people get offended a lot um just by me like just being real and speaking speaking my truth or whatever but yeah i don't know i don't know if i could handle me if i wasn't me so i don't blame people for not liking you or just like really seeing you seeing your light and being like a little irritated or triggered by it because your light really shines bright it really does it really does and this is not to say that you are the most positive person but it's to say that your heart is pure as gold your heart is pure as gold and your presence is felt <laughs> you're felt like you're you're a very pleasant person like on the inside though on, on a much deeper level from the inside out on a soul level your heart is pure as gold they not like us chosen one People, people can see you, sense you coming from a mile away. They can sense you coming from a mile away. And that's either going to be triggering for some people because it's going to irritate their demons. Or it's going to be such a positive experience for people that they got to know who you are. That they got to figure you out. That they got to speak to you. That they got to be around you. That they just want to be in your energy. They just want to be in your presence. Like they just really attracted to your aura. Your aura is amazing. Your aura says it all about you. Your vibe speaks before you even have to, before you ever have to. People already know what it is with you. They already know what's up with you. They already know that you are a person that they can confine in. This is why you have people opening up to you and you may barely even know them. This is why you have people just attracted to you in your physical presence and you maybe just met them or like like you don't even know them. People just want to be around you. They are not like us chosen ones. When you look out into this world, when you see all of this dark negative negative energy like or just low vibrational energy, it does not amount to the vibe that you give off 
it does not amount to what you have to offer. You have so much to offer. You have so much to offer. And when you break down the things that you have to offer, it's a lot of non-physical things. It's a lot of non-physical things. People are attracted to you on a deeper level than your beauty because you have that. You're beautiful. You're handsome. Yes, we get that. But people are attracted to you on a soul level. People are attracted to your essence. People are attracted to your vibe. People are attracted to your intelligence, the way that you speak. People are attracted to the things that you are attracted to you because of the type of things that you are attracted to, the type of things that you like to do. People are attracted to your free spirit. Your free spirit is like no other. People are attracted to you because you are able to be you unapologetically. No matter if it's that goofy side that comes out, no matter if it's that serious side that comes out, you own it. You own who you are. And this is what people like about you the most. They are not like us chosen ones. You are compared to no other. You are like no other. When people see you, they can't think of who reminds, like who you remind them of, just barely, unless it's another chosen one. I had a chick come up to me at the beach. She like, oh, I thought that you was this YouTuber. I didn't tell her that I was a YouTuber as well because I don't tell everybody that I have a YouTube. Although I can tell that she is very tapped in herself. I just don't really get into it with a lot of people. Like, it's a very small percentage of people that I meet that I tell her I got a YouTube. But she like, oh, I thought you was this one spiritual YouTuber. I'm like, yeah, I'm spiritual too. I could have said like, yeah, I'm a YouTuber too. But no, it wasn't that deep. They not like us chosen one. It's not that deep for you. It's not that deep for you. Everything that you're doing, every move that you're making, you don't have to announce it to the world. You move in silence a whole lot, a whole lot, because you've recognized that, you know, it's better to accomplish your goals that way. They not like us chosen ones because you actually got goals. You actually got goals. You got dreams. You got desires. You you want better, like, and the average person, a lot of people, they don't have goals. A lot of people don't have goals. And it's not to say that you like, oh, you about to go start this business or you about to do, like, this or that. But it's like, no, you got personal goals. <laughs> you got personal goals. You got things that you're obtaining. Like, you thinking about uh, your future, like, you got goals that make you happy on the inside. You got you like to do things that make you happy. They not like us chosen ones in your spare time. The type of things that you like to do besides chill, okay? Besides chill and relax in the normal stuff. You are into like divinity, like you're into nature, like <laughs> You're into things that some people may call weird or wacky. You think for yourself. You don't need any type of uh, person or any type of religion to tell you which way to move, where to go, which way to jump. Like, you, yes, you have a connection with God, but that doesn't have anything to do with someone else outside of you because you are god that doesn't have anything with someone else outside of you telling you how to live life you live life on your own terms they are not like us chosen ones they not like you they not like you you living life on your own terms no matter who may feel some way in the process because people gonna feel some type of way they are but you a whole grown adult out here, okay? <laughs> and you've realized that. And you realize that you have to make moves for you. You got to make moves that make you feel good. You got to make moves for your family that... And I may be talking about your small family. I may be talking about your family and your household. And your, your big family, they may not like that. But you're, like, you've... Like, you're... Like, you're figuring it out, <laughs> 
you figured out that it is some type of formula to this. It is some type of formula to peace. It is some type of formula to happiness. And anything that does not align with that, anything that does not align with your goals, you're not really entertaining it that much. Every day, you're learning how to say no. You are rejecting the things that does not align with who you are, that does not align with your peace, that does not align with your goals and your serenity. You are very serene. You're very serene. Your essence is on 1,000, okay? Your essence is on 1,000. Many times, like, you'll be out, like, don't don't let you go nowhere. Don't let you like go somewhere important. Like you looking super cute. You looking super bossy. Okay, you looking super dope. Like you are. And on your average day of just looking regular, you're still looking good. <laughs> you still, but more importantly, your energy is just speaking. It's speaking to people and. For a lot of people, it really feels good. Like you have an effect on people that the average person just can't give off. They are not like us, chosen one. <laughs> they not like us. You move the room. The energy in the room shifts when you walk through that door. It shifts. And like people be trying to figure out like, is they some type of celebrity? Like, what is it about them? They want to know what it is about you. Everybody else is walking by. Everybody else is walking down the street. Everybody else can get by. You cannot go unnoticed. No matter how hard you try, no matter how hard you try to fit in, your presence does not go unnoticed. They are not like us shows on. The effect that you have on the world is very massive. It's very massive. Your vibrations are high. Your vibrations are higher than the average person. The average person that you see, the average person that you may have grown up with, have hung around. You were able to step out of that and step into your God-like self. They are not like us, chosen one. Many people don't even know that they are a God, that they are a goddess, and that's okay. It's not to say that we are any better, but we are truly Free. It's very foreign. <laughs> I love having a free spirit, okay? I love it. I would take this any day over being put into a box, over being who society says that I should be, over doing what society says that I should do. You take a lot of risks, chosen one. And that's what makes you very special. It makes you very special. The way that you put yourself out there. <laughs> You're very unique. I can go on and on and on and on, okay, about how they are not like us chosen one. But I'm going to end this video here. <laughs> I'm going to end it here because I can go on and on. I can, I can speak about this all day. You're different in the best way possible. You are. So if this video resonate, if it hit different, let me know how so. If you are new here, I do invite you to hit the subscribe button. If you do not have Chime, okay, Chime is like the mobile banking app. It's super clutch. You don't need to pay any monthly fees. Um, and more importantly, like you get a free hundred dollars for signing up. So click the link down in my description box to learn more information on how you can get your free one hundred dollars. Y'all, I love my Chime account. OK, I absolutely love it. I don't think I will ever get rid of it. <laughs> Look, if you're not a member, I invite you to become a member on this channel because we live over on the membership side. That's all I have for this video. Stay spiritually used. Stay spiritually in tune. And I see you all in the next one. Peace.